my channel today we have a leg workout for you guys today and today's workout is gonna be very just glute focused and as you guys can see I am wearing my bathing suit and that's because I'm gonna go work out outside and I don't want the terrible tans um, but I do I am gonna start off with some of the exercises indoors so then like that I can just go out there and do the rest of them um, before we get started please make sure you guys hit that thumbs up if, and hit that subscribe button. Honestly, guys, it helps me a ton when you guys do that for me. So if you guys really love this content, make sure you guys give me that little present of the like, subscribe, and if you wanna write whatever comment or whatever, or just let the video play, that's fine too. Anywho, so today's workout, we have a variety of different exercises. We're gonna start off with kickbacks on the leg extension machine. We're gonna do some clamshells with bands. We're gonna do some cable glute squats with the cable back there. We're gonna do some hip thrusters. So it seems like we're gonna go a little bit heavier on these today. Awesome. Then we have some body weight lunges and these are more to focus on my form. I, my form sucks on the lunges. So we wanna make sure that does go down greatly. And then we have some band kickbacks. Um, each leg to a failure. So obviously we still have to count because we want them to be even though. Right, Mr. Joseph? This is not my handwriting. So you guys can see Joe is in medical school. This is a doctor's handwriting. So if you can't read it, it's okay. It's not just you. Um, it's been taking me years of practice. But anyway, let's go ahead and get started. All right, Frodo is spotting Stephanie on the uh, glute kickbacks using the uh, extension machine. Checking the other side now. Good job, Froyo. So, you guys probably have seen kickback machines at the gym. They use a lot of glutes and quads, but given the angle going upwards, it's gonna put more emphasis on the glutes. Can you see everything? Yes. You can see everything. Very impressive. <laughs> Oh, no, she's just watching too. Okay guys, so next up we have banded clams and these are for our outer glutes. And for this Okay guys, so next exercise, we're gonna be doing some banded clams. So these are for your outer glutes. And yeah, here, as you, can see, yes, you guys can see, I have different sizes for the bands. Uh, for me, I typically have to start with the lightest one just because for some reason my external rotation um, It doesn't like to open up too much So I kind of have to like warm it up and then eventually I will get to like the heavier one. So we're gonna be doing four sets of 12 um, Kind of holding it at the top. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and Put these baby on We're gonna lay down then you want here and then move back. You're gonna feel it right here. You're gonna come back down and come back up. For the next exercise, we're gonna be doing some kickbacks. Uh, for these, I like to do them laying down just because it keeps my hips leveled. I've noticed that whenever I do regular kickbacks, I'll tend to like swing back. Um, so I'll definitely include them in just because I wanna make sure that I'm stabilizing and making sure that I'm not, you know, moving, doing this, which I'll see a lot of girls do. There's a lot of like different things that you shouldn't do. The first one is, you know, whenever you're doing a kickback, you shouldn't like literally like reach back out because you're not really using your glutes. So you want to make sure that your hips are even. You're kind of like tilting forward if you're doing a thruster and then you're kicking back. So, so for me, I prefer to do this one laying down at least just to like activate the muscle and then you can move on after. So what I do is I lay down and then I kick up. Okay, next 
next exercise we're going to be doing some hip thrusters and the set and rep counts are down here so this one for me is 10 reps Next up, we have some body weight lunges. And for these, the reason why they're body weights is because we're gonna do them as slow and controlled as possible to make sure the posture's right. For me, as I said earlier, I suck at doing lunges. I get all kinds of crooked. And so I've been really trying to reteach myself how to do them. So this is important for me to do. Um, so the biggest thing for me is just keeping my hips squared and bringing my glutes forward. Like that is the glute that is doing all of the work and not every other compensating muscle. So. for it. So, we're going to go ahead and get end of my workout I am exhausted so try this out honestly like whenever you do I, I'm doing a lot of these new exercises that are more body weight lighter weight and just a lot of isolation and a lot of people think oh my god you're not doing anything it's not hard but if you really focus on that mind muscle connection I promise you you will get a really good burn and you will get really tired and you know especially when there is a good amount of volume in there so Slow and controlled is the key to all these exercises and really focusing on the, um, the mind-muscle connection. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Please make sure to hit like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.